This is the first heat of the men's 3,000 metre steeplechase. The final is on Monday, and if both main protagonists make it through, and here's one of them, I think, I'm going to put this out there, I think this could be one of the races of the games. So the first of three the heats in the men's 3,000 metre steeplechase. Albert Carley has gone straight to the front, but then he looks over his shoulder, dribbles his way out into lane two and says, no, not interested, come on, somebody else do the work. <laughs> Charlie, the Olympic champion in the red. 600 to go. Keita coming wide on the outside of Wale just to make sure that he got a clean run at that water jump. Wale from Keita. El Bacali tucked in in fourth. Leonard Bett followed by Kibi Watt. Only the first three, remember, guaranteed a place in the final on Monday night. And what a final it promises to be. Crowd really getting involved here, Gail. They're they enjoying are. it. They are enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> And now El Bacali coming up onto Wale's shoulder. Two Kenyans in hot pursuit. Leonard Bett oh, yeah, and Abraham right. Kibiwat. Martos is furiously driving. He's going to have to keep a close eye on the clock, but at least he turned it into an honest pace. <laughs> El Bacali from Wale, who's taking the third automatic spot. Oh. Ooh, Wale. Oh. Looks like he's going to be run out of it here. El bacali has got this race on an absolute shoestring. El bacali from Bet, from Kibiwat, and Genet Wale and Martos will have to wait and watch the clock. He was only 0.67 behind, but that means that Wale is not one of the three automatic qualifiers. But how about that? from El Bacali, what was it, 8.16 plus, and he made that look like a jog. The yeah. Olympic champion is in top, top form. I think that's quite a good tactic from Gurma, you know, because they were running so close together. Of course, he would have been very comfortable at that pace, but he thinks, hang on, I've got aspirations of, of a world title here. I don't need someone's heel right. tripping me up. Anything could happen. Get away from me. And that's an indication of someone's class scale. He's been at the front for nothing more than about, what, 300 meters and he split the field instantly <laughs> now coming round this time it'll be the bell now Balaji is running well in fourth place they take the bell in this second heat and a KG one at that in the men's 3000 meter steeplechase one of the favorites for gold Lama Chagurma leads for Ethiopia Hillary Ball the former Kenyan now Proudly representing the United States. Still in the mix. So too can Cessus Capruto. But Balaji, the French national champion, who's got himself up to 338 for the 1500 metres this year. He's running well on the outside. Capruto, remember, is the reigning defending champion. He's in fourth. One of these men is going to face an anxious wait to watch the clock. Because only three are guaranteed an automatic spot in a mouth-watering final. Gurma looks okay. Oh, he's just motioned to the rest of them. I think he was getting a little bit annoyed. So Gurma's leading, Benaji and Bohr, and Conceslas Kipruto, the defending champion. Yeah, leaving it very late, but coming home in second ahead of Bohr. Benaji will be the one who has to wait and see. Gurma takes it. Wow. I mean, El Bacali made the first heat look easy, Gurma made the second heat look easy, and as if this final couldn't get any more mouth-watering, 
that's the best performance I've seen from Conceslas Kipruto since he won this title beating Germa by a hundredth of a second three years ago. The defending champion is back.